Hello and welcome back. It's the blogcast. It's uh, success blogcast. Welcome back, everybody. Happy April 22nd, 2020. And uh, it's a kindness Wednesday, so be extraordinarily kind to your family members, please, especially those of you with siblings out there. You know how hard that can be, but you can do it. I know you can. All right. Uh, I was going to come to you from outside instead of my underground classroom. But it is so windy, I couldn't make the sound work. So, um, I recommend, though, to you, it's going to be a sunny day today, get out there, do something active, maybe go for a walk, uh, put a ball around, kick the ball around, whatever you'd like to do with your family, get out there and do something fun and healthy. Um, yesterday's kindergarten uh, day was uh, very well received, and thank you very much. I actually received a picture of a kindergartner, look down there, Try to figure out who that was on their first day of kindergarten. And thanks so much for sharing that. I'll talk to that person uh, tomorrow. So I don't want to give away who it is right now. All right. Um, it's Administrative Assistance Day, which means people like Mrs. Raglan, who is amazing. And I don't know how uh, Conestoga would function without her. Please say hello to her. Please reach out and say thank you for all she does for us. I know I'm going to. Um, just make her day a little bit more special, please. And speaking of special, Jelly Bean Day. And um, I'm not sure if many people know this, but I'm a big fan of jelly beans, especially the black licorice flavored kind. Uh, simply the best. Um, enjoy Jelly Bean Day. Maybe let me know your favorite. I also like the popcorn, buttered popcorn flavored, but stay away from those uh, Harry Potter beans. Ugh, nasty. All right. Uh, thanks for sharing in my Dropbox, especially my mystery kindergartner. Um, if you want to join our new photo Dropbox, it's A-W-B-X-Q-H-X. -X, and I look looking forward to people's uh, photos and whatever you'd like to drop into that Dropbox soon. Emails yesterday. Wow, very busy day. Uh, Hosanna, Katie, Lexi E, dollar sign, dollar sign, dollar sign. Uh, Madeline. Landon. Gianna. Audrey, Vanessa, Kaylee, Max, Eli, Morgan, and Leo. You can see we were very busy yesterday uh, getting work done. A matter of fact, I will be updating some uh, statistics as we move forward. And I am so proud of how much work we are accomplishing in our classroom. Um, yesterday, was, we had a great Google Hangout. If you couldn't make it because you were doing something else with your family, hey, we get that. Uh, but please uh, join us on our next Google Hangout, which will be Tuesday, next Tuesday, which is the 28th, and we're kick that off at nine o'clock and can't wait to hear from you then. Uh, I will be sending out before then uh, a prompt so that you, we, our conversation can be a little bit more stimulated than with what it's been so far, but I know we've been doing great and uh, it's always good to see everybody's face. So please join us at our next Google Hangout. The end of the year committee still wants pictures. If you have baby pictures or other pictures from your very early childhood, please send them. Uh, there's a link over here to show you how to do that and where to send them. I will be meeting with those people tomorrow afternoon, so I can't wait to hear the ideas we have, and uh, I will share those ideas then. Okay, writing. Let's get to it. Um, I received two great shark stories, like fantastic shark stories. I did return those. Uh, there are notes on those, so please take a look at my notes and get back to me. Um, also, please check out Morgan's Untitled audiobook. I shared it in classroom. It's uh, located in the folder titled Morgan's Amazing Story. Wonderful. I'd like to do that for other people too, so please get a hold of me and, and let me know um, about your writing and let me know if you would like me to turn some, one of your writings into an audiobook to share with our class. Absolutely fantastic, Morgan. I love doing that. Um, let's see. Do, 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 do. Make sure we're checking out Google Classroom and all of our writing assignments are in there. Just need to accomplish one of those. All right, reading. Please check out Mr. Mattern's Google Classroom. Everything you need to complete our reading assignment for this week is in there. Tomorrow, there is a Google Hangout. Um, it starts, oh, I don't have a start time. I'll get that to you on the blog. Uh, there's going to be a book discussion about the book we're reading, The uh, Long Walk to Water. And uh, please see Mr. Mattern's blog for dates. 
spelling. We have password tomorrow, chapter four. Jump in there. Um, I know Lincoln and Aud are our current champions. Will there be a new champion this week? We're going to find out. Maths. Wow. We completed 22 projects yesterday. Uh, just, and that's an, it, that doesn't sound huge to you, but to me, it's amazing. Uh, in one day, that, that's almost half of our class getting things done, and that is amazing. Um, remember, there are four choices. Check that out in Google Classroom. Complete two uh, of those assignments. Um, and please get a hold of me if you are needing some help. There is a quizzes game up and running on mean, median, mode, and range. Uh, you get three plays. The game ends tomorrow at 3.30. So please, I uh, would welcome you to challenge yourself and get in there and work on mean, median, mode. Uh, also, I would recommend taking a calculator along when you go into that game. Um, I'm looking forward to my first, and, and a little nervous, I'm going to be honest. I am looking forward to my first Google Maths Hangout. We're going to be talking about uh, mean, median, mode, and range and how to find those things in case you missed that. Um, we'll be meeting today at 1. People have been sending me emails, and I've been sending out invitations to the people who have been emailing me, so I can't wait to get that done. And as we move forward, I'm looking forward to doing even more math hangouts as uh, we get into deeper and deeper into sixth grade maths. All right, science, there are three potential projects. I got a whole bunch back yesterday. Um, I also, in addition to those three, if you have an independent idea, for example, like I talked about yesterday, here's my lettuce experiment. And if you can't see it, there are roots growing, like a lot of roots growing from a piece of lettuce that we were gonna throw away or put into the compost pile. Uh, Poppy the guinea pig gave me a little leftover, and now I'm growing more lettuce. So that's an example of a, a science uh, project that I'm conducting. Here's another one that I'm doing. I did this one for my wife, for Mrs. S. I grew these in our garden, and as you can see, a lot of tulips. Uh, and so I cut these off to beautify our uh, dining room. Mrs. S. loved them, and uh, the buds will be opening further and further, and maybe I'll keep you all updated as to the buds. There's another potential science project in the offing for sure. Okay, um, please submit one of three projects or again, your independent idea. Social studies, see Mr. Mattern's classroom for everything you need in social studies and make sure you turn in one project in social studies. Rats, okay, at least 100 stars, at least. And whoever my fairness person is, I, I'm sorry, I forget if, that, if it was Landon or or Lincoln, I forget who it was. Maybe it was Morgan. I'm not sure. Um, please check out her rat. It is amazing. It, there's like 22 slides. It's about the Hunger Games. The details are incredible. Um, Audrey, you did a fantastic bang up drop. I highly recommend after you get done watching this lovely face that you go and check out that amazing rat. It was fantastic. Okay. Uh, don't forget, Audrey, that does count as your writing project. Wow, it was far more than I could have expected. And anyone else who's doing a rat, don't forget that counts as a writing project. Remember to use Sapphire uh, a little differently these days. We're just looking at what work has been returned to us. And please, just if you see a little R next to an assignment, that means you've returned it, I've seen it, and I accepted it. Um, if you don't see an R, you uh, either didn't maybe didn't submit it, maybe it was way early in the morning and I really didn't get to it yet, or maybe I returned it and you need to do a little fixing here and there. So make sure you're using Sapphire to check out your returned work. Um, great, great job using Google Classroom, everybody. You've stepped up to the challenge, you've met it easily, and wow, all of the work yesterday with the exception of one, uh, side project was submitted in Google Classroom. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am also looking, if, if you uh, are just joining us and because of whatever, we, we don't care, please jump in and get into the work that we're doing. If you wanna go back and do past assignments, make sure you're doing them in Classroom and make sure that if it's an old assignment that you wanna submit, that you get a hold of me and let me know that you're submitting that so that I can see that. Okay, that's all I have for this amazing, uh, Wednesday. It's a kindness Wednesday. Hopefully I get a 10 in kindness today. There's a lot of work for me to do today and I can't wait to get to it. Um, remember Conestoga to stay healthy, stay strong, be kind, and of course, be Conestoga proud. Happy administrative 
Assistance Day, Mrs. Raglan, we really care a lot about you. Everybody else out there, take care. Bye-bye.